Hey folks, welcome back. So Jason here is off to college and he needs a mode of transportation. So we thought about, what did you think of? Boosted board? Yeah, electric long board. It's got a motor on it and stuff, but it's expensive to make and there's issues with the amount of battery power and stuff you could put on a small board like that. So, so we, we decided to have a go at an electric bike. Um, seen a few designs uh, and thought we'll try a try and build something so this is what we uh, what we came up with it's a pretty cool design this battery here which powers the entire system is actually a 400 watt hour battery we built ourselves using 18650 batteries you can buy them in bulk on eBay um, relatively cheap it's way cheaper than actually buying a lipo of equivalent size it was an excellent way to go for this project. Yeah, so we had to assemble that thing, 3D printed a lot of parts, yeah. um, and custom built the battery to fit in. So it's a 10 cell, uh, 20 amp hour battery, um, and fits nicely into the space, keeps the center of gravity low. The whole control mechanism is this Arduino up here. It's, uh, we programmed it ourselves to drive, send a signal to the ESC, uh, displays, it's got a screen on it, outputs power and, um, uh, current throttle and all that sort of stuff and then we have our motor over there and this is a what 125 kV yeah uh, motor yeah. a 2 kilowatt motor uh, 3d printed the uh, the gear here uh, with a timing belt and uh, that drives everything uh, we actually fitted this to a, a sprocket that we put on here a freewheel sprocket so that um, when you're going downhill you're not uh, driving the motor backwards uh, and then we put uh, built a BEC uh, and a current sensor in here and that current sensor feeds information back to the Arduino yep. So we can get uh, we know what the motor is doing and control that and uh, what's the gearing ratio on that? that this we're is using? A, a 12 tooth to a 128 I think was a 128. Yeah, and okay. that, so we get a pretty high torque uh, the problem with this that we ran into is uh, the torque stall on the on the motor um, if it's yep. if it's too much load for it the motor will stall uh, and that's what a lot of the code in the Arduino is doing monitoring the current making sure that this motor is not stalling uh, because it's got too much current and too much power but uh, this is it uh, a yep. lot more work than we thought it was gonna be yes <laughs> many many weekends you, we get yeah. what we thought was close and then oh no there's all these other problems that take another couple weeks and yeah. then more problems and dragged on yeah printed. turned out to be a lot longer yeah trying thought. to get the teeth right and i think we printed Oof. like six of these gears at trying, least trying to get yeah. them out 12 yeah. hours of print so it took a long time yeah. each time yeah. but uh we finally got something that goes pretty good we're going to yeah. take it for a run and see what kind of speed we can get out of it let's do it let's go check it out all right, all right. That was a pretty successful run. That thing moved. So we clocked this. I was following him, not an accurate reading, but just under about 30 miles an hour. Um, so, but he was doing yeah. 20 pretty easily. Easily, um, yeah. And yeah. that, it's a balance between how much power you're putting in and how much you're draining the battery versus how much speed you want. It seems like keeping it around 20 max um, is drawing what, 10 amps? Yeah, 10 amps is giving me the most efficiency because as with all motors they have an efficiency curve and you get in the peak the battery's going to last the longest so, so yeah so we think we should be getting close to an hour's runtime on this so which yeah. is fine for what you're looking for oh it's more than enough and uh yeah perform well so we're good to go see how it works thanks yeah. for watching guys hope this was uh, interesting and uh just another uh perspective on e-bikes yeah if you liked it be sure to subscribe stay up to date on all our 
content and videos and stuff uh, drop it a like if you like yeah, it as well absolutely thanks a lot guys take care